Welcome to the procedure of processing of information systems. Three activities in an information system produce the information which any organization needs to make decisions, control operations, analyze problems, and create new products or services. These basic activities are input, processing, and output. In the step of input, data is prepared in some convenient form of processing. The form will depend on the processing machine. For example, when electronic computers are used, the input data could be recorded as any one of the several types of input media, such as magnetic disks, tapes, and so on. In processing step, input data is changed to produce it in a more useful form. For example, paychecks may be calculated from the time cards or a summary of sales for the month may be calculated from the sales orders. Output. When the results of the preceding processing steps are collected, they become output. Information systems also require feedback, which becomes an output and it is returned to appropriate members of the organizations to help them evaluate or correct the input stage. Let us look at this video to check an example of processing of information. Car wash. The input is the car, the cleaning products, the machinery or person that washes the car, and maybe the person driving the car through the car wash. The process is putting all those things together to actually wash the car. The output is hopefully a clean car. Feedback might include some method of gathering the customer's opinions or determining if the chemicals are enough or the water is the right temperature and then making changes to the system. You get the point. 